These twins have never met, but they share a special bond. To join twins! That's right. All four sets of twin girls were born conjoined, and they all underwent life-changing separation surgery. But look at them today. 11-year-old Abigail and Isabel Carlson of Bismarck, North Dakota, were conjoined at the chest and shared one big liver. Their separation surgery was among the riskiest. Right here, like chest to belly buttons. It's really fun to say that we were joined at the hip. <laughs> Lexi and Sydney Stark of Denver were joined at the hip and spine when they were born 16 years ago. Our spines made a U. Their mom Emily says the operation to separate her twins was very risky. Thank goodness it worked out so well. Our worst case scenario would be paralyzed from when they were joined down. Best case, we got it. <laughs> Everyone was thrilled to meet each other, can join yeah. twins just like them who underwent separation surgery. Like typical kids, they take selfies and exchange social media contacts. Who else on Instagram? I do. Oh, I do. A lot of people judge when they see, oh, what happened to them? Well, like, I don't judge because I know the struggle and I know yeah. what it's like. She stole my belly button. So. I did. I have two belly buttons. <laughs> Macy and Mackenzie Garrison of Des Moines, Iowa were conjoined at the hip. Their separation surgery left them with one leg each. Okay. We uh, buy shoes together. We never thought there was other people like us. Kendra and Malia Heron are turning 15 today. They were born conjoined the same way. Would you rather use crutches or a walker? Crutches. At Boondocks in Salt Lake City, all eight girls go bowling. Woo! The odds are not in their favor to be alive, let alone to be thriving. Woo! Miracles, all miracles in one room. Woo!